what we're really talking about here is that all of the problems that we struggle with, we tend to externalize. We tend to solve them in the external world. And there are certain ones that are practical in the external world. Do I have food? Do I have shelter? Those kinds of things. But beyond a certain basic level, a lot of the problems we're trying to solve in the external world are actually internal problems. And even if we manage to solve the current manifestation in the external world, the new problem will just pop up tomorrow in the external world. Everyone's looking for truth, whether they profess to look for truth or not. And the evidence for that is that everyone is looking for a way out of their problems. If they weren't, then there wouldn't be 14,000 prescriptions on every single corner from spirituality to self-help. The very fact that those things exist and the very fact that they are populated by millions means that there is an enormous appetite for relief from problems. This relates back to prescriptions. No human being actually wants to be told what to do. There's something within a human being which rejects the idea of being told what to do. Quite frankly, even when you do give prescriptions, most don't follow it. And they will beg you for years to get the prescription. And when you give it, they won't do it. People look at that and say, see, you've been given the prescription and you didn't follow it. That's your fault. No, it's not. The fault is believing that that's what they really wanted. It's not. No one wants prescriptions. Freedom really is what everyone is looking for. It is just that they've been sold many lines. They've been sold many lies that it's about meditating and it's about practicing mindfulness and it's about doing all these things. And none of those things are wrong. It's all about the question. If your question is, I like to feel better for 20 minutes a day, it gives me a sense of peace, what can I do? There's nothing wrong with that. If the question is, I really want to have peace in my life. I don't want to have problems every single day. My entire life is spent putting out fires. I don't want that anymore. That's a different question. Then those prescriptions are invalid for that. So what is the most important question? I would begin with the one that's most acute for a given individual. Now, broadly speaking, everyone's problem is problems. Anxiety, fear, concern, worry, conflict, confusion, 